Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be leaving pictures right here from your iPhone, iPad, or Touch. It's going to be the exact same instructions for all of them. So let's get started. On the top, I'm going to see my Photos app. So that's exactly where we need to go. Let's just go right into Photos. And then from here, we're going to see Recent. So in Recent, it's pretty much everything that you've got on your phone. So there's actually quite a lot that I have here. And the way to delete one or all of them, I'm going to teach you how to batch delete plus delete one at a time. So to delete one at a time, yes, you can select the picture, then delete it. Or on the top right hand corner of your screen, you're going to see select. Just click on select. Once you tap on select, select that one picture that you want to delete. On the bottom right hand side, you're going to see that trash bin. Just tap on that trash bin. It's going to say delete photo, delete, and there we go. So right now that has me deleted. If I want to delete several of these, well, I'm going to tap on select again. Then this time I can just tap on that one. I can tap on another one, another one down here below. Uh, that's a video, by the way, it's going to be the exact instructions if these are videos. And down here, there's another one, tap on delete. And there you go. Now let's say I want to batch delete. Now, if you have like a thousand pictures, it isn't that bad what I'm going to show you. However, if you have a lot more than that, maybe I would suggest hook it up to your computer and do it from there. It's going to be way faster. But right now I'm going to show you how you can do that right here without having to plug your iPhone, iPad up touch to your computer in order to do it. Anyways, tap on select. So what we have to do is just tap on the first picture, then slide our finger to the right. So that's exactly what I'm going to do right now. Slide it to the right. Then just keep sliding your finger downwards, down your screen. It's going to select everything and just keep your finger down here, just above the trash bin. Now, the closer you get to that trash bin, the faster this will go. So right now, in just seconds, I have selected 302 items. So that includes a lot of pictures and videos. I can just tap on that trash bin on the bottom, right hand side, click on delete, and there we go. There's nothing more here. So they have all been deleted from my internal storage. So they're not taking up any space from my phone or iPad or iPod touch. I do have that free space. However, if you guys want to fully delete these, you have to go back. So just tap on album that's on the top left hand side. Then scroll all the way down. And on the bottom, you're gonna see recently deleted. Just tap on recently deleted. And you're going to see everything that you just deleted. So if you deleted something by mistake, you could recover it from here. However, we're going to fully delete everything. So on the top right hand side, again, we're going to see select. And this time, we're going to see the option to delete all on the bottom left hand side of our screen. So let's just tap on delete all. Uh, now before I do this, just in case, on the right hand side on the bottom, I do see recover all. So I could recover some stuff or recover everything if I did this by mistake. So I could recover everything if I did this by mistake. Anyways, we're going to tap on delete all. And this will actually finally empty up the space. Here we go. And now we have that storage back so we can keep taking pictures. So if your phone was just full of pics and videos, you couldn't take any more. This is the way to do it. Right now it's fully empty. You have nothing else to do. You're good to go. I do want to mention up here, you're going to see my photo stream that doesn't actually take up space on your iPhone, iPad or touch. Well, maybe it takes up like a megabyte or two, but that's just because it gives you a preview of pictures that you are streaming between your devices. It's online. It's not something that's meant to take up storage on your device. So don't worry about my photo stream. You can delete everything from your photo stream just to reset it. But you don't have to. At this point, you're actually done deleting all the videos and pictures from your device. Everything else that's left over would be already online. So it doesn't again, take up space on your device. As far as this video goes, we are all done. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.